What's up, guys? I am your host, Elise Desiree, and welcome back to The Daily Dive. Today, we will be discussing 6-foot, 186-pound OU quarterback transfer Dylan Gabriel. Let's dive in. Gabriel attended Mililani High School in Mililani, Hawaii. As a senior in 2018, he had 3,754 passing yards and 38 touchdowns and was named Gatorade High School Football Player of the Year. He finished his career with 9,948 passing yards, 105 touchdowns. Gabriel started his college career off at UCF with a bang. He entered his first year as backup to senior Brandon Wimbush, but took over during the first game and started the final 12. They finished with a record of 10 and three and a win in the Gasparilla Bowl over Marshall. In 2021, Gabriel was injured in the final play of a regular season game, and it ultimately led to a season ending. Despite the injury, Gabriel had a wonderful career at UCF. He had a pass completion percentage of 60.7, 8,037 passing yards, 70 touchdowns, and 14 interceptions. In 2021, he announced he would be transferring from UCF. On December 16, 2021, Gabriel originally announced that he would be transferring to UCLA, and almost a few weeks later, he announced instead he would be going to Oklahoma to be led by Coach Brent Venables. Gabriel is set up to fill the void left by Spencer Radler, who transferred to South Carolina, and Caleb Williams, who transferred to USC. Gabriel has a history with OU offensive coordinator Jeff Levy. Levy was the former quarterback coach for UCF, and Gabriel played one of his best seasons as a true freshman under him. Levy recruited him and has named him the starting quarterback. In an article by John Williams on the Sooner Wire, he states that soon Jeff Levy will unleash his fast-paced offense on unsuspecting defenses each and every week during the 2022 season. The Sooners have high expectations for the season quarterback. And although he isn't in the running for the Heisman, he is still anticipated to have an exciting year with the Sooners. I look forward to seeing the Sooners take on UTEP at their season opener on September 3rd. If you would like to learn more about Dylan Gabriel, please feel free to check out the linked articles in the description below. Also, be sure to go ahead and like, subscribe, and hit that bell to be notified when we drop our next video. Don't forget to leave a comment letting us know what topics you would like to see covered on future daily dives. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. For more, click here.